He does have this buff, the ranch needs me. He feels like the ranch is falling apart. Babe, you don't have a ranch. You have a sleeping bag and some aubergines and some wild peri glass. This is not what would qualify as a ranch bestie. Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be getting a taste of the new game pack. Sorry, expansion pack of The Sims 4. Welcome to The Sims 4 Horse Ranch. Own and train your horses. Customize your hoofed friends in Creator Sim or get new horses by rescuing, purchasing or breeding do in fact love the fact that we can rescue horses learn the riding skill and train horses in temperament agility and jumping skills to compete at the equestrian center bond with animals fill your ranch with adorable mini goats and mini sheep and invite neighbors to see how cute they are raise foals to become lifelong companions and champions make a life on the ranch spend your days keeping your animals happy and clean harvesting prairie grass to feed them collecting manure to fertilize your plants and making your own nectar do it all in a ranch you design. Enjoy a thriving community. Chestnut Ridge has a lively social scene. Your sims can go into town to meet friends at the bar, blow off steam at the dance hall or train at the equestrian center. You can host cookouts and dances on the ranch and hire a ranch hand to help when the work builds up. For this LP, the sim I am going to be using to start this let's play is in fact my sim self. I'm not very good at making sim self. I don't think he actually looks anything like me. The only thing that is quite similar is the acne and the beard. But apart from that, that's basically just a black sim. <laughs> that's racist. That's racist. That's offensive. That's offensive. Stop that. This is my sim self and this is the sim we are going to be using to start this challenge. First of all, we're going to look at the new traits and aspirations that we got with the horse ranch pack. We got one in the athletic section, which is championship rider. And we also have one in the food section, which is experts nectar maker. I've kept away from all early access content, but I do in fact know that nectar making is a very OP way of making money in the sim. So I'm excited to give that a go, but I have gone for the championship rider but the main aim is to do a rack to riches with the nectar making we do have two new traits we have the rancher these sims excel at ranch life and take pride in their work they enjoy ranch chores and caring for their livestock we also have horse lover these sims share a strong bond with horses they have an easier time socializing with and caring for horses than any other sims so this is my sim self and i have given him some stuff that came with the new pack this top these and bottoms and the cowboy boots are in fact from the new pack we also gave him this is his cold weather wear but his everyday work kind of looks like this and he does have a pink bandana which as you can see we have a matching one right here i did want to go for like the whole cowboy outfit thing but the hat i have isn't exactly a cowboy hat so we just have the bandana and that's what we're gonna have throughout the let's play okay so this is the world of chestnut ridge I have already moved us into this lot and don't worry it's bulldozed we will be starting with zero simoleons and nothing on the lot say what you want about the whole ranch expansion pack but the world is really good i really love the world it's really cool i hate my life i did in fact find out i was not filming <laughs> the entire time any i'm gonna give you updates on what we have we met marissa which i did have a crush on in the trailer marissa tracy and we have a good compatibility with her and he also finds her very attractive so in case we want to you know dabble in the romance we also met umber which we found very attractive but he is married to juniper there is also this um like change outfit like store out here there's not really much function to it but it is really cool we also have the grocery shop that i was really excited to try out <laughs> we can buy mini goats and mini sheep which when you think about it, it doesn't sound right buying mini goats and mini sheep that sounds like mutton chops like it sounds like we're buying like goat produce and stuff we also have the equestrian center over here and um, we can purchase a horse and rescue a horse we can also enter competitions here horse training sell horse and spectate competitions i did think that the rescue horse option was going to be like you find a horse in the wild just like the cats and dogs but you just like pay money and you get a horse which i don't know why you would do that instead of just rescuing a horse for a lesser price it doesn't make sense to me i thought this was going to be somehow like the stray dogs and stray cats in the um, cats and dogs pack but you know it's fine the competitions i am hoping that the competitions we will actually see the competition being held at the back and it's not going to be like a rabbit hole event because that would just be disappointing because why even have the horses if hopefully i don't do the whole not filming thing again i haven't actually seen any horses around i've not seen any horses out and about okay there's someone over here agnes <laughs> what is going on okay it took a while for her bike to load but i thought she was riding a horse i'm just gonna introduce myself to everyone let's do a howdy introduction 
we have been talking to marissa for a while but i'm just gonna leave her to do her job in her very bloody don't worry about this this is custom content i don't know why she has it on but it is custom content that i have love how everyone is getting um drinks and i have nothing i do in fact love these nectar like wine boxes i do find them really cute why is the paparazzi here is someone famous around the only person i see is simon silverswear and janae <laughs> if you know janae you know that me and janae have sort of hit history from my werewolf pack my werewolf sim did in fact hate her so you know check out my werewolf series thank you very much we didn't finish it but they're about to do some married couple shit because i don't want to get in the middle of that i just want to say hi to your wife thank you danny Davila, the girl from the trailer I'm gonna introduce myself to her i don't know why they have the bloody costume on like it's so creepy but what do we think of danny Davila? we find her very attractive we are also neighbors so you know that's cool okay that's enough socializing i can only take so much let's travel and see what other lots we can visit we could bring marissa it could be our first little date but i think it's too soon to be dating anyone so we're just gonna take it at a slow pace we are gonna try to flirt with her maybe later in a different episode but for now we're just gonna be on our lonesome okay okay we've seen the bar we've not seen the nightclub we've not seen the park and i'm but i basically think the park is just going to be um just a lot nothing really much to do i don't really like parks in the sims 4 but i do in fact want to see what's like up with this like galloping gulch it does seem like a very scary haunted part of town i do want to see what's going on there back on our lots i did want to make the first episode about like kind of exploring things about the park that we don't know yet but i'm not really seeing much i think we've basically explored all we can we just need to get a horse do the nectar making and that's basically it honestly what i do want to do is i'm not sure if we should get a job or we are gonna make money solely from nectar making or maybe we do some odd jobs i'm thinking not sure but what I do want to do is I do want to give myself a bit of lot challenges. But yeah, so I'm not going to go with the off the grid. I think I might go with simple living. It did come in cottage living. Um, I want to go for wild foxes. Wild prairie grass day after day. Wild prairie grass will pop up and spread out the seeds of this hay. Um, are there any new lot traits concerning like horses? Not really. Maybe bracing breezes. I think that's going to help us with horse riding skill. Maybe geothermal, just to help us on bills, basically. What I am going to do is I am going to check out the new items that we have and see basically what we want to get. We do want to get an animal shed. We want to get a chicken coo. Um, <laughs> The way I went to the like game pack section to find horse ranch, but it's actually an <laughs> expansion pack. Um, horse barrels. I don't think we really need that because we have a bunch around the world. So buying that would be kind of a waste of money. But making nectar is 350. So what I do want to do is I would want to get a bit of money so we can start planting stuff. And I think that's the way we start, like getting money maybe from planting the crop. Yeah, I think we are going to start from planting crop. Overheating from being hot due to temperature. I do not want to die on my first episode. That's giving me like flashbacks from my attempt at the not so very challenge. I do not want to die on my first episode. Okay, so please change to your hot weather outfits. Um, I did want to try fishing, but for some reason we can't fish here, even though there's a sign. So I may try to use the two mod and maybe that should work. Okay, yeah, that does work. So I think that's a glitch from the game. Basically gonna fish for a few hours, maybe till evening. I also do want to check out the nightclub. I do want to do some line dancing because as I said in my whole strange features video, that is one of the highlights of this pack. That's the best feature the pack came with. While doing some fishing, we did get um this embrace the change um notification. We are gonna get a new personality trait, which is Mikel is starting to love the house, the outdoors. Embrace the change. Yes, I am gonna do that. It should be helpful since we are going for a farm like ranch life even though we are still fishing level we are fishing level two now but we are getting a bunch of fish so i'm gonna keep going okay we are at the nightclub i did expect to see a bunch more sims here we did a bunch of fishing we sell that for 14 and that for seven and that for 23 and this toy that we did catch fishing we can sell that for 285 simoleons so that's really good so the first order of business we do have a bunch of money if you want to start like the farming thing so i am gonna save up for a bed and the farming thing also maybe the nectar making station okay so i think this is the line dance that we've been hearing about 
I do want to try the line dance. Cowpoke dance. Is that what it's called? I'm gonna try it out. That sounds fun. Okay, I'm not seeing much of actual Chestnut Ridge residents. Makoa is here. Candy Bear. Makoa came all the way from Sulani. The Fangs are here for some reason. I want to do the group dance thing. I do want to do the group dance thing, but we don't know any of these sims. Forget everything I said about this game pack. This pack is... It's, I'm actually really excited to try out everything in this pack. Forget everything I said. I love it when the sims glitch. And then everyone is just looking at each other in silence. Oh, Rory's here. I love Rory. Rory, love you, babe. Love you, bestie. Okay, I'm loving this dance. I'm loving this dance. I am loving this line dance thing. Like, look at that. So cool. What do we think about Dawn? I think I have the first impressions mod, but we do find him unattractive. It is 12 a.m., so I am going to go home now. We are back home. We've had a great night. That concludes the first day of our time in Chestnut Ridge. We do have a bunch of money, so I do, in fact, want to get ourselves kind of settled. We need a bed. We need a house. But what I am going to be smart, and I am going to get, because you need, to, you need to spend money to make money. So I am going to get the garden patches from the cottage living pack. We can get three, maybe. And then I do think we need a bed. Okay, we have two cottage living beds. We have the $300 one. That one is a single bed, but it is also $300. We could go for a sleeping bag for now. And we could go for the nature's relief bush. Actually, I think I'm going to save some money on that nature's relief bush. Because I think we have an outhouse nearby, like a public toilet nearby. So I think we can save money on that. Maybe. I just realized that I gave us the simple living trade. So it's... It is going to be harder to get food. I did want to get a fridge. We can't actually afford a fridge. So, you know. So, this is all we have. Maybe you can do some cross stitching on the side. Not sure. But that's all we have money for right now. We're going to go to bed. Have a perfect view to tell story. I did not know that was a thing. We're going to go to bed. Have a look at the stars. You can't see the stars because my render distance is, in fact, set to low. So, we're just going to imagine that there's stars up above. Oh, it's raining. Oh, how sad. But one thing is that this whole pack is about horses and i have not seen a single horse i have not seen a single one getting up nice and early we are hungry we are also uncomfortably wet but i think it's time we purchase some oversized crop let's purchase some oversized crop seeds i'm gonna get some pumpkins actually let's get the cheaper ones let's get lettuce and aubergines and maybe some mushrooms we've acquired the gardening skill he does want to enter a master horse competition from the aspiration he also wants to reveal an animal feeder from being a rancher. But most of all, he wants to eat because he is very hungry. I think we have a grill. And I think as far as we're not on the lot, the simple living trade doesn't apply. So if we go out of the lot and find the grill, we should be good. That was a lie. Maybe he maybe he has to be out of... Oh. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. I don't know if this is a mod. I think this came with the high school years pack. But Sims can, like, ask your Sim to be best friends. And Marissa Tracy has just asked us to be best friends. So maybe she has a crush on us too. Maybe she has a crush on us too. But of course, of course, we are going to be best friends with her. But I think maybe if we are not physically on the lot, we can use the grill without like the ingredients. But we are going to have to test that out. She actually came to our lot. She is over there. But babes, I need to eat first. Okay, I'll catch up with you soon. Where is he? Okay. So now that we're off the lot, I think we can't, no, we can't, <laughs> we can't, we can't grill. And who said this was a good idea? Who told me this was a good idea? Oh my gosh. Um, so what are we going to do for food now? Um, I'm not sure how we are going to eat. Let's get franken beans. We need onion and any meat. So why don't we use our last bit of simoleons to order something? How do we, how does this work again? Order delivery? groceries yes uh so we need onions and any meat i think yeah let's get some red meat we do have some new interactions we can ask about getting a horse we can also ask her about the community getting and selling horses horses can be purchased and sold for simoleons a horse's value depends on their skill levels past competition performance quality of care and age if a horse has champion genes this will also increase their value horses can also be rescued at a reduced fee Due to the environment they come from, rescue horses will have more difficult traits and extra attention and care may be needed. Okay, so that's the reason why you might prefer buying a horse than rescuing a horse. You can find additional Im information about the community by using the community board. You can also purchase one for your home. 
um okay so our groceries are here okay so we have our ingredients now i am gonna head over to the grill if you are wondering what happened here what is going on here is because my game did crash so that is your reminder to save so i had to watch the footage back and like put everything back where it was with like relationships and money and like what we had on our lot garden plots with our aubergines lettuces and mushrooms lettuce <laughs> lettuce and mushrooms and we are still trying to chat up with them while we wait for our things to grow and we also got our groceries i do want to kind of lay out the friendship um foundation before going in for the romance silly behavior no let's go a joke tell a joke about horses i think he has that option because he's a horse lover and i think she likes comedy so she oh she's absolutely she's absolutely balling the knee she's hysterical babe she's hysterical he also wants to encourage horses to breed from being a rancher and i have set my game to save every hour because yeah i don't want anything to happen i can't take any more risks so what i'm thinking i'm not really sure if i should go down the like odd job route because obviously gardening is a very good way of getting money but at the same time it does take a while for like the money to start coming in so i'm thinking maybe we do get some odd jobs to kind of do while we wait also to get some money because we do want to get a horse we do want to get farm animals we want to get a house those kind of things so <laughs> i forgot my sim was already enrolled in university okay so we're gonna have to drop out of university uh, on the online streamer so we're gonna have to quit that job too need a mixologist photos for publication we have none of these okay this one requires no skills just made a huge order from babs waffles but i'm far too weak to pick it up okay so we can do that one new milestone drop downs from life events oh i've never got that before perhaps university simply wasn't for Mikael and other great things away it's still dropping out almost once almost always feels like a bit of like failure if only because that's what that was that makes no sense <laughs> this pack might not have come with enough features to be called an expansion pack but they really did a good job with the world like look at how cute these falling ivies are with these grapevines outside like this lot it's so adorable then we have this arch over here and i'm thinking we should wait for these grapevines to kind of sprout because i think that's how we're gonna have to start our um next making career but we did get a bunch not a bunch actually we got very little money from the odd job i did find something we could dig over here oh someone made oh lord bless you babe someone made some chimmy so we're just gonna grab a serving and one thing i really like again about the world is the background like birds chirping it's really very wholesome it's just very calm and chill and i really love that we are so sad because we haven't washed our hands in a while that's the least of your problem babe maybe we could we should a bunch of these in <laughs> in sack lunches and carry them with us don't tell me your bitch that is my lunch that is my lunch you live all the way in copperdale i'm sure you have you have a fridge i'm sure you have a stove so why are you taking my lunch what is your problem not sure what's going on but danny here came over and she has basically been here for a bunch of hours which is typically not normal for sims after a few hours they do tend to leave but she has been here and she's been chatting we have been chatting like we almost have the same relationship as me and marissa i'm not sure if she's into us i'm not sure if she's into us but we just have to wait and see but they have quite a good bit of banter between them they do both like gardening and they are both like they don't have good compatibility based on the game he does have a better compatibility with marissa but we'll just have to see where things go sienna grove is here hi bestie how you doing that's a very grungy outfit love that for you but we are going home i think danny is still around and i don't really want to be in like a love triangle situation because i do think danny and marissa are in fact in the same household and we got a lot of our on our hands we have the simple living trait we have a whole ranch to build up we don't really need a love triangle situation right now up bright and early we're gonna do some gardening we need to water our plants and we also need to spray for bugs he does get the one that he does want to be friendly to livestock from having the rancher trait but we also have this um um wants that he wants to cloud gaze with danny the silver the villa the villa he wants to cloud gaze with danny the villa and i'm not sure what that's about I mean, if he does find himself more interested in Danny and finds himself getting more closer to Danny, we have no choice but to actually 
you know, move forward in relationship with Danny. But, you know, that's his choice to make. We also have this prairie grass growing around and we can sell it for five simoleons. It's not much, but we could add it to our passive income. Sim tolerated, animal approved, a staple in ranch life. Prairie grass grows and thrives just about anywhere with no sim care required. Prairie grass is an excellent food source for ranch animals. Who will nibble on any prairie grass they can get access to? Grass that is harvested or grazed on by animal will take time to grow back. When they mean for ranch animals, I'm hope so hoping they mean for like the cows and the llamas we got from cottage living. Because I did in fact want to see a bunch of um a bunch of cross pack compatibility between those two packs. I think they really work well together. We could sell this mysterious time capsule we got from digging, but sometimes the item inside tends to be like a lesser price than the actual capsule itself. So I'm not really sure if you want to take the chances, but I will open it up and see what we get. Look at this cool animation he does when he's clearing the prairie grass. How exciting. Mikhail made a discovery while searching the prairie grass. He Discovered a green bean. Ooh, we can plant those, I think. Um, I think we can plant these. Yes, so I'm just gonna put those down. Can stock that animal feed. But for now, we don't really have any animals. So I think it's better if we sell that. Either what was in that capsule was, in fact, way less than $70. So it would have been better if we just sold the capsule itself. I understand that you're disgusted, but you are quite in a very tight living situation. So, well, to get a bit more money, let's find more odd jobs this one needs video gaming level 2 which i think he does have i think we're gonna go for the first one because i do think he does have video gaming skill yeah he does video gaming level 7 and he does have this um emotes emotes this is not fortnite babe he does have this buff the ranch needs me he feels like the ranch is falling apart babe you don't have a ranch you have a sleeping bag and some aubergines and some wild peri grass this is not what would qualify as a ranch bestie i am loving this love triangle drama i am loving it so much so marissa actually texted us hey i heard you become friends with danny de villa they're pretty cool so is she trying to throw shade or is she genuinely just happy that we became friends with her roommate not sure but we're still gonna keep our hopes open i'm not sure who we are gonna gravitate towards at the end i are for one rooting for um marissa because i do think she is really cute i have had a crush on marissa ever since we got the trailer so i'm hoping we go for marissa but i've been waiting for this wild um what's it called grapevine to grow but it's taken ages so i'm basically gonna watch it grow because i have nothing better to do so we got a call from agnes crumplebottom and she gave us one of those um inheritance like questions and i do know if we go for underwear conditions we get um 2500 simoleons but is that kind of cheating since we are doing a racks to riches i am not sure as delhi says if it's in the game it's not cheating but i kind of feel a little bad doing that a slow grind is kind of like the best part of a racks to riches but i think i am going to do go for the first one now that you've accepted i must inform you that you only get this money if you become married within seven days and immediately danny calls us i'm in a bit of a weird place right now do you mind if i come crush <laughs> what is going on in this town so we got a call from agnes copper bottom telling us that we are gonna get some money if we get married in seven days and all of a sudden danny wants to come over and stay in our house i promise i won't take up much room i just need to get away for a bit we do also know that she is roommates with marissa so could that be a little you know fight between them i don't know but i'm gonna accept oh that is that is interesting that is interesting that she says she's gonna come and stay over I haven't actually done any stay over events ever since I got the growing together pack. So she's going to stay over till Thursday. So basically a four night stay over. That is a lot of time. This is getting way more interesting by the day and I'm really loving the drama. I'm just on my own doing a bit of ranch work. Actually this is not ranch work. Yeah, like you wouldn't see it right now. But Marissa just called us and invited us to the humor and hijinks festival. And I think we should go with her. But I think I do want to go with our humor and hijinks. I want to give both of them kind of a chance that sounds a bit snobby of me like because that is my sim self Ooh, a horse a wild horse with no one riding oh is there someone on this horse or is this a glitch <laughs> who is riding this horse i found the ghost horse you guys can we do a friendly introduction let's introduce ourselves to this horse and if no one has that horse but i am taking that horse for myself bestie the horses are really good they really did do oh gosh that horse does not seem well another thing our vet like are vet clinics able to like cure horses like 
Do horses get diseases just like dogs and cats? Um, this is Aleki Parata. I'm gonna brush his coat and tell. Oh gosh, now we're getting horses all over. Umber Grove walking by with his horse. Hygiene's excellent. Hunger is good. Everything's. She's doing amazing. Oh, we got a bunch of interactions with horses. We can tell jokes. We can talk to. We can mount the horse. I mean, <laughs> what do you mean? Ask about endurance training? Like you're not gonna be. Like, it's not going to give you any ride back. Let's go for an energetic ride. This is not our horse. I do not advise this. Please do not steal horses. But I do really want to see what it looks like. I do really want to see how it looks like when we ride our horses. His hunger is low. It's fine. It's not my horse. Not my responsibility. <laughs> it's not my responsibility. She can come over and she can get the horse when I'm done right. Oh, gosh. Hey, bye, bestie. I okay, so I guess we're not getting that. Bunch of love from Rancher Trade. So I'm going to see if we can invite Marissa around. And then I'm going to try going for the Humor and Hijinks Festival. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I didn't realize that Danny was already... Oh, gosh. This is awkward. This is awkward. Danny's suitcase is here. Marissa is here. They are roommates. So obviously it makes sense that something happened between them. That's why Marissa is here. And I am, am I going to have to ask her to the Humor and Hijinks Festival in front of Danny? I think we are. Okay, we are here at the Humor and Hijinks Festival. I love how she changed into a more appropriate look. I think that's a randomly general. I don't, I'm not sure what's going on. She has the <laughs> custom content handbag. She has some custom content accessories in her hair. I'm not sure what's going on. And I love how I have just kept my like cowboy outfit, my ranching outfit. I'm like, this bandana cost me 200 simoleons. I will not be taking it off, bestie. <laughs> So we're just gonna join one of the teams. I'm feeling more of a jokester. He still wants to cloud gaze with Danny. So, so he's got to give me mixed signals because why are we going to the festival with Marissa? And then we are thinking about cloud gazing with Danny. So I think he's kind of confused. Oh my gosh, Kyle, look at those muscles. Wow, Kyle is, Kyle is, Kyle is, hey, he is, he is hot. <laughs> Okay, we've joined the jokes does we have found out that marissa is ambitious love that for you babe okay so i'm just gonna go ahead and do a bunch of tell a bunch of jokes at the stage that like the humor and hijinks festival is very easy to win and we do get 500 simoleons from that so it's a win-win situation we get closer to marissa and we also get 500 simoleons and i think that's gonna be enough for us to start our nectar making business as i said we won the hijinks festival we have i think we got three things we did get a bit of fame which we don't really need we're back from the humor and hijinks festival and i don't know what's going on we are feeling tense she was feeling sad about something and he got the buff from getting like a sad stay over guest i'm not sure what's going on i'm gonna leave this part right here we have a whole entire love triangle wish that happened to me in real life but that has never been the case and danny was sad about something i'm not sure what it is we're gonna have to check that out in the next episode because that's all i have for you guys today please leave a like and subscribe and youtube thinks you're gonna like this video so see you there right and i'll See you guys over there. Good damn bye.